lots of clouds again today in West Michigan. Got to tell you, I was a little bit too optimistic on that sunshine outlook for today. I thought we'd break into some, to be honest with you, but we missed our chance. And as I said earlier, today's our fourth straight overcast day. Pretty sure that tomorrow and Friday we'll make it five and six. If there is a reward, a silver lining on that cloud, it's that we'll see sunshine for the weekend. We start off with a live look at South Haven. Hello, South Beach Live. Looks like one person out there enjoying the beach. Got it to yourself out there with your chair. A few folks out there on the pier as well, but what a gorgeous view. Let's check out our forecast model to show you when some showers and storms are going to be moving in. Now, this evening, you're good to go as we run our clock all the way up until 11 o'clock. And notice nothing going on. Skies will be cloudy. But one thing to note is that our temperatures are going to continue to be really mild for this time of year. Remember, 40s for overnight lows are common this time of year. It's the average. But as we run our clock here over Overnight, you'll see that we're going to be nowhere near that. In fact, as the rain moves in by about 5 o'clock in the morning, we'll still be in the mid-60s. And so it's going to be a little bit sticky out there, too. Your morning commute tomorrow will be wet. The bus stop, wet. So you've been warned. Make sure you have that rain gear ready to go. Showers, I think, will continue moving through tomorrow morning. In fact, it looks like the next couple of days are going to be wet. Let's take a live look in downtown Kalamazoo, where, like in South Haven, it is overcast. We're looking live right now with our Peregrine Tower Cam on the Kalamazoo Mall. And against that backdrop of a gray sky, you can see the color from those changing leaves there up and down the mall. It's a beautiful scene there. The temperature right now is at 70 degrees. Our typical highs in the mid-60s. So in the daytime, we're not really far off that mark as far as average temperatures go. It's at night when we're really well above average. However, those daytime highs are going to be zooming over the weekend. More on that in the seven-day. Well, our temperatures right now, upper 60s, low 70s. We were checking in South Haven Live at 70 as well. All quiet on live Doppler radar. This is our 100 mile scan. So let's get in with Storm Tracker. Uh, you can see the clouds again and some showers building well off to the south here around a system that's going to be moving that rain right on up into West Michigan during the day tomorrow. In fact, it will arrive overnight. That's what's in the forecast. Cloudy and mild with some storms in here by dawn. We'll see an overnight low of 62 degrees and then for tomorrow showers and scattered thunderstorms. Not expecting anything severe. It will be mild and a bit humid with a high of 72. Your Sealy Auto Group seven-day forecast, showers in the outlook for Friday too, and then we break out into sunshine and warm temperatures. We're talking about low 80s for Sunday and also for Columbus Day with a chance for some storms next week. Uh, these temps are really crazy warm. I mean, we have had 10 straight. Today is our 10th straight warmer than average day, mm. and we're going to be tacking on at least five or six more this is a warm spell that is persistent. It's a little too late for 80s, and one time in March we had a string of 80s, and that was too early, so yeah. they've got to stay in their lane. <laughs> <laughs> we have to tell Mother Nature that. Stay in your lane. Right. Stay in your season. I was worried we were going to get a frost soon, but it does not look no. like it. You know what? I, I'll tell you what will break the cycle here is if I go get some moms and put them outside. Don't boom. jinx it. I have a mom, and it's beautiful, and I just want to preserve <laughs> it as long as possible. Well, the moms are in good shape for a while. It'll right. bring the freeze weather back. Mom's the word yeah, then, that's right? That's right. Oh.